Amanda, you started out as a newspaper reporter in Rhode Island. Tell us a little bit about your career history and how you got to where you are today. Sure. So I'm from Rhode Island. Um, I grew up there. I went to college in DC. And when I was home on summers and like I would freelance for this tiny community newspaper. And I did some other freelance journalism as well. So when I graduated, I had I'd gone to study journalism. When I graduated, um, I ended up going back to this like paper that I had worked at. Um, and I spent a lot of time doing like um, interesting, fun, uh, like things like you cover like the sewage treatment plant yeah. or like town council <laughs> meetings, which actually is really interesting because there's such like, um, it seems like on the surface like really simple, but as you delve into things mm. in like communities, you find like a lot of like interesting stories and beats. So I did that for like, I think like six to nine months or so. And then I was like, you know what? I want to move to New York. Um, and one of my mentors at a different paper I had freelanced for had connected me with someone that had worked at this um, small, like it was called Media Bistro. I don't know if you know yeah, it. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah very so familiar. it was like the early stages of this company. So they were mainly known as like this job board. They had a blog network yeah. and they also had this educational sort of community there. So it was like in the era when it was first like writing for the web is a big thing. Yeah, or, like yeah. I'm going to use WordPress. Like what does that mean? And that changes were first happening um, in the publishing community and the media community specifically. Specifically. So I ended up getting a job there as what was what they called an education assistant. And I basically helped schedule, plan, and run these in-person and online classes. It was like early stage online learning. So I did that um, for a few years. And one of my mentors there uh, ended up getting recruited by time and she took me with her. And I've been there since and she actually started her own company and I ended up taking her job. So that's like sort of my trajectory. 